simple instructions. And finally, it's Hagler against Hearns. The chairman's going to have to go. Eloquent simplicity by Richard Steele. Let's go. He knows they know. Staring at each other through the national anthem. They stare down, of course, so customary before these fights. And here we go. Round one. Hagler, right off the bat, attempting to get inside. He'd love to be able to pin Hearns on the ropes if he can. A more aggressive start by Hagler. Look at him right for the body. Marvin Hagler only wants the body. He bangs Marvin. Oh, Hearns may have hurt him with a right hand. Hearns on the right. Hearns hits him with an uppercut. Hagler, he's hurt. 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 Hagler is stunned. Hearns got inside. Hit him with a right uppercut. Marvin ties him up. Marvin Hagler is still hurt. So is Hagler coming out like a bullet. A good left by Hagler. But Hearns didn't flinch. Marvin going for the body. Wild first round. Wow, what a shot. And it was Hagler who initiated it, not Thomas Hearns. And a left by Hagler. Hagler. Hearns comes back. Another right. That one stunned Hearns. What a first minute of the fight. Tommy Hearns has been able to drop that right hand in, and it has hurt Hagler, a surprise to many people. Another right hand from Hearns. Hearns moving. Hagler still pursuing. Comes in with a right. Mix him with a left hook. Here's where I believe Hagler should turn to righty. He could block that right hand easier and he would land his own left hook. Hearns with a devastating punch. Swelling near Hagler's left eye again. Tommy trying to come inside the hands of Hagler. Low blow by Hearns. Hagler still looking for the body. A right by Hagler. Good right got in. He has Hearns where he'd love to keep him on the ropes, but Tommy comes off easily. Another good right by Hearns. Hagler is now shaking those right hands off, though, Al. He was stunned a little early, and he's normally a slow starter. He's also bleeding. Hagler is cut. Hagler is cut. Bridge of the nose. Hagler hit him low. He is painting the body well. He is taking shots to the head. He blocks that right. Hearns tries to come in with the uppercut, and Hagler ties him up with a minute to go in a wild first round. But Hearns trying to box his way out. Half a minute to go in round one. How far can this one go? That's very far at its pace. This is where Hagler wants him, but Hearns counter-punching off those ropes fairly effectively. Oh, tremendous first round. Hagler hitting him to the ropes. Working on him, but Hearns uppercutting again. Hagler bloody. A tremendous motivational first round as Hearns gets hurt. Hearns got stunned. Hagler was stunned early in the round. Great first round. Wow. Incredible. Perhaps one of the best in middleweight history. That was an entire fight in Memphis in three minutes. Off the ropes, 
coming back and trying to land that right. They are yelling, keep boxing Tommy from his corner, and that is, looks like what he's going to try and do in this fight. Turn. Off balance, off balance, and Butler now, stepped on, not Handler, close to a knockdown. Excuse me, Al. Handler turns righty. I think this could be a key moment in this fight. For the first time, Hagler switching, gets in with a left hand. This round sort of the way people anticipate in the first round yes. might go. Another right hand, stunned turns. The crowd, of course, emphatic over every punch that's thrown. Hagler... Despite that least disadvantage, has been able to get into her, and more so, I think most people expected. For one simple reason, good left hook by Hagler. He took the best hand Hearns could offer, and he did come in. He's, he's getting through that right hand, even though he's getting hit with it. Halfway through, round two.